Then I'm going to show you my essential oil collection. This is like the one of each essential oils that I have. And then in here, these are backups because almost every oil that I bought from Puritan Pride has buy one, get one free. And then the oils that I bought from eBay, from this um, seller that had, that's like an organic seller, um, it was buy one, get one free as well. Even though it didn't tell me when I bought it. I was just so surprised when I opened up the package and there was doubles of everything. But um, let's start with myrrh. So myrrh was buy one get one free and it was $14.99. So myrrh was one of the more expensive -er, expensive -er ones. And whenever I think of myrrh and frankincense, I always think of the Bible, you know, when Jesus got those oils when he was born. Um, but myrrh has a lot of great properties. Um, it smells... It smells very intense, very woody, and it also s tells you the, the scent here. It's very spicy and earthy, and I just think it smells really intense. Um, kind of like a smoky scent, too. And um, this is not pure myrrh. It's myrrh in comforting in jojoba oil. So it's, it's in jojoba oil, so it's not like the purest myrrh. But... Um, it's still very great and it says used to soothe dry dull or aged skin and it has a lot of like properties like I even wrote down somewhere was it here like this is when I was writing like why I wanted my essential oils and all the reasons and and like recipes um, but I wrote a, a page of all the essential oils like when I wanted to when I was like in the process of like why I wanted to buy them so I can like narrow it down and it just has a lot of antibacterial and antifungal properties I believe and a lot of these oils kind of like have some of the same properties but um, it's also the scent that makes me want to buy certain essential oils um, another one is citronella oil and this was a cheaper one this is 849 and I got two of them and when people think of citronella they always think of I don't know if you saw that sorry they always think of you know products that are used to drive the mosquitoes away but I just I really love the scent it's like almost lemony very citrusy and it's just strong and I just love the scent that's mostly why I bought it but all these oils have their own properties and I'm not gonna list all of them because that'll take too long I'm just gonna describe the scent and um, everything actually this is lemon oil and I actually put this in this bottle my sister actually bought the lemon oil it was a huge oil and I was like I want some of that so I just took this bottle that I bought from Mountain Rose Herbs the other company I was talking about and I just put it on here so I have the lemon oil too so carrot seed oil, carrot seed oil was the most expensive. I got two of them for $30 basically. But whenever I was looking at the ingredients to make your own like skincare products, a lot of them use the essential, um, the essential oil of carrot seed because it is so good for you. Like it's so good for your face for cell re um, renewal and just protection and anti-aging and just amazing um, benefits for your skin but it smells intense like it smells so strong and it also has like ugh, I don't really like the smell but it kind of grows on you it kind of like reminds me of like like a bit of a grape like a very distant scent of like something grapey but it also says the aroma is earthy and woody and it's a middle note whatever that means oh but it also has a a like recipe here for a facial mist carrot seed um, rose and water hmm. 
Maybe I'll try that. But carrot seed is really expensive oil, but it's because it has so many benefits for your skin. Then I bought frankincense. This is what it looks like. And most of these oils from Puritan Pride are from Aroma Peel. That's the brand. Ugh, this one smells so bad, too. It's just really strong. Um, well, it doesn't have the thing here. It just smells really earthy. Um, and then I really wanted... Oh, the frankincense was... Oh my god, it was expensive. It was $27.19 for two. So it was about almost $15 for just one, basically. And this is just because it was on sale. So it's expensive. That's why I got it. Because it has a lot of properties too. And then I got rose, but this one isn't isn't pure. This rose essential oil is in sweet almond oil. And I wanted to get rose because rose was a lot of, was in a lot of um, recipes for just calming and like, just, I don't know. It just appealed to me. And it doesn't even, like the smell isn't really that strong. But, but it does smell a little florally. And rose, the rose one was $15.29 for two because it was on sale. And then I got sandalwood and let's see, sandalwood was um, less expensive. It was $9.89 and this one is in jojoba oil. So it's not pure, pure either, but it doesn't even smell like anything. Like it smells a little bit, a little earthy, but it's not too, oh, and also it's, yeah. But yeah, I don't know what I was going to say. Um, one of my fears is that I don't close the lid on really tightly in this in this plastic bag and it's going to spill all over. But I don't know. But one of my most exciting oils is the vanilla oil because I love sweet vanilla scents and everything. And this one was... Sorry. I think this one was, it says 1529. And this is what it looks like. And this, this isn't the pure one either. It's in jojoba oil. And it isn't like too strong, but I've used it in one of the products and it really does smell sweet. So that's why I love it. And then all of these little ones, like little oils, like little essential oils, are the ones that I got from eBay. It came in a pack and it brought five of them, I believe. Yep, five. And I and I bought it from the eBay seller, um, the dash plant dash guru. And they were $9.99 for all these little five essential oils. And I wanted to get this pack because I just wanted to try these without spending too much money on them. And what else? Oh, and they also included like double. Like I didn't know that it was going to be $10 for $10. So basically each bottle costs a dollar if you technically do it out like that. But um... They're really strong and really intense, but they're really small. So even though I was like, yay, I got, you know, each bottle was like a dollar basically and I got two of them. They are really small, so I use a lot less of these because I don't want them to go away. And I also gave some to my mom because um, lavender, I don't really like the scent lavender, but it's really good for calming and everything. And then I have the eucalyptus, eucalyptus here, and it, I love eucalyptus. It's very invigorating, very minty and strong and intense. Um, I got rosemary, and rosemary smells really intense too. The rosemary has a lot of properties. It kind of smells like menthol. And then 
I got sweet orange and sweet orange is one of my favorites. I love anything citrusy, lemony, orangey. And I also love like sweet smells like vanilla and like, I don't know. I just love everything. But sweet orange smells so good. And then I got peppermint just in case, you know, I wanted anything pepperminty. And you can also use these in your bath. You can also put um, some essential oils in water and do like a refreshing a refreshing mist for like your scalp and your body and spray it all over your room so your room can smell great. So it just has a lot of great properties. Essential oils. And you can use them for many things. That's why I invested in them. And now I have to go over some of the butters that I got from eBay and Mountain Rose Herbs. So let me just make a new video for that. I also wanted to say that Puritan Pride also sells teas and they also sell supplements. And I got this nettle tea because it's, um, it's good for your allergies. And I'm trying to get rid of my allergies the natural way. So that's why I got them. But just Puritan Pride, you can just literally get anything you want for a good price and get good deals so I suggest everyone go check out that site it's great so let me go over some of the things I got on eBay um first is I got these cute little labels because I wanted to label the jars and label like um, my products just so I can know which one is which and no, and I wanted to name them because I wanted to be cute like that. And just some of the ingredients, like I made this serum and I call it Heavenly Dreams. And I put a bunch of things, but the most important oils in here are rosehip and carrot seed. But I also put argan oil and just a bunch of other essential oils. And it literally like has made such a difference in my skin in just the one week that I've started using even in one day like when I put it on that first night I made it I woke up and my skin was literally so amazing so plump so moisturized the little pimples that I had on my face were like drying out so just amazing but anyways these labels I got I think there's like 25 in here and they and it cost two seventy nine, so two dollars and seventy nine cents, and it was free shipping. Most of the times I always get free shipping. Actually, sh shipping was ninety nine cents, but most of the time I try to get free shipping. And um, this was this was a seller, Tanage Roulette. I'll probably put that down in the link down below. And then from eBay, from the Plant Guru, the one of the sellers that I got the essential oils from I also wanted to try um mango butter and this seemed pretty legit because on eBay I don't want to buy anything too too cheap because I don't want it to be bad I want it to be a good product and this raw mango butter was $16 and that's pretty much like the average price that I saw for many of the butters is for 16 ounce or one pound it's um about sixteen dollars and um yeah it's a hundred percent raw mango butter and i thought that this was gonna smell like mango but it has no scent at all literally has no scent but it's really chunky and it's in blocks and it's really hard but when you melt it to make your skincare product it melts really easily and it says it has vitamins a c e omega 9 and it has uv protection which is great because i'm also a believer or starting to become a believer of naturals sunscreens and next summer i'm probably going to make my own sunscreen because now i know how to and yeah you can put this in your hair and in soaps and moisturize and body butters and that's what I made. And then also from the same seller on eBay, I got vegetable glycerin. Because in a lot of um, skincare and in a lot of the brands like Josie Moran and Fresh and like a lot of brands that I saw online, I saw that they use vegetable glycerin in their products. So 
I wanted to buy one and this literally is such a huge like bottle is 22 ounces and it was only 11.49 and it's 100 percent vegetable glycerin from the plant girl and i think i'll definitely buy from this person again Used and you can a use lot it of ingredients as well so that was it for ebay i just bought those one two three like four things from ebay that i couldn't find or that were a little less expensive on ebay than other things but a website that I'm truly, truly happy and excited for is Mountain Rose Herbs. And I'm excited because this website is kind of like Puritan Pride. It has ingredients and it has oils and they have their own essential oils and their own skincare. And they have deodorants and they have clays and they have butters and they have just so many things. And they also have jars and tins and different things because it's just a great brand and I follow them on um, Instagram as well but what I got were um, amber one ounce amber dropper bottles because when you're gonna make your own skincare and you're gonna use essential oil it's better to get an amber glass bottle because um, the light affects <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my throat or my voice but the light effects the oils and it kind of changes the chemical properties in it so you want to get a dark glass bottle and keep it away from the light and keep it away from like extreme temperatures so nothing causes a reaction so that's why i got them and these are really cheap a one ounce bottle was a dollar wait i got two of them And it's one twenty five each, I believe. I think. Um, and I got two of them, and they each come with the droppers, like the dropper things. Actually, this is the one ounce. I got two one ounces, and then I got this one is a two ounce, and the two ounce is one fifty each. So I think I I I really don't think that's that much. Um, then I got 50 millimeter amber glass jar, which is this one. And this one I have an eye cream in it, but the, the eye cream kind of came out like bad. I didn't do it that great, but it's still really moisturizing. It kind of just broke apart. But um, a 50 millimeter glass jar is a dollar and fifty each. So I think that's pretty good as well. But I actually think it's kind of big. Especially for what I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be an eye cream jar. And this is kind of big for eye cream. Especially if you're trying to go through it fast. Because natural things expire faster. So I'm going to see if they have smaller glass jars. And then a 9 ounce glass jar. Oh wait. No, that was... So the 9 ounce glass jar, which I think it's this, I really don't know. Is this, is 9 ounces bigger? I think so. So this one was $2.25 each. And this one I created a body butter and it's so good, it's so good. I think I am going to share my recipe for that one. It's so good. Um, and then I got half ounce tin and each was $0.65. Cents. So, so basically this is a half ounce tin and it was 65 cents and then the four ounce tin which was this and I actually made a bomb for my everything a four ounce tin is a dollar and then I got little misters for the um for the amber bottles just in case I wanted to create a facial mist and I did and these misters were 75 cents each and then I got Carnaba wax organic and I use beeswax in a lot of my things that my sister had left over but it, I also wanted to have like vegan skincare options just because I'm trying to be more vegan but I also use a lot of bee derived products but I, I wanted to try out other types of wax so I don't have to rely on beeswax and this wax is from the Brazilian wax palm tree so it's a uh, plant wax and it comes in like little flakes and it's really good 
a lot of organic companies use it and this one was a pound for $21 so this whole thing was $21 but I feel like this will last me like a year or two like it literally will last me so much because you only need a tiny bit of wax like a teaspoon of wax to make things a little thicker or a little um, more harder and then I got cocoa butter and it's organic and fair trade and I got a pound or 16 ounces for $16 so it really didn't so for the from the eBay seller I got a pound for $15.99 basically $16 and then from the Mountain Rose Herb Company I got this cocoa butter and it was the same size which was six um 16 ounces or a pound for $16 so it was pretty much the same amount and then the same price but this guys oh my god the cocoa butter smells so good this is what it looks like inside really really hard really thick so not really that great to use by itself because it's hard to like just scrape but come melt it and combine it with other butters and oils to make your own body butter and it's amazing and it smells like literally I could just sit sit in my room and smell this all day and be entertained and be calm this literally is so good it's expeller pressed from the whole cacao seeds it's great for to get radiant skin and it's just unrefined organic it smells amazing this is what it looks like I really hope this is not upside down so that's another thing that I got and that's I think my favorite product my favorite and then that's basically it that's all I got from Mountain Rose Herbs and I'm definitely gonna purchase from them again and I love that I started this natural skincare journey but like I was saying I am so great that I started this natural skincare journey and um, taking a lot of steps towards a natural, healthy life all around. I'm, I still am complex about my makeup because I have a lot of makeup that is not natural and organic, but, and I love makeup. So I'm still complex about that and being 100% um, vegan altogether just for different reasons, but I do love that I'm taking the steps towards a healthier, natural, vegan life. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I can edit this video and get it up and make more videos. But I'm so excited for it to paint my room and revamp my room, get more lights, get the camera on Black Friday, and just make more videos for you guys. And thank you so much for watching. Bye! Subscribe!